and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to be doing a DIY mural painting of some flowers. I have this wall that's been blanking out and looking at it. I'm like, what am I going to do with it? So the first step is to draw out the design. I drew out a flower design giving me an idea of what I was looking for in a notepad. And I am going to put this flower design above my desk, my crafting desk, in this space. So it's going to reach to the top. And over here, I have two shelves. And I'm going to make the flowers expand right and left. So let's get started. Step two. I drew the pattern on the wall with pencil. Now you can't see it very well, but it's on the wall. It's not drawn perfectly. You don't need to be perfect. You can fix your imperfections once you paint. But the design has flowers, stems, and leaves. And I went all the way up by the doll, up to the top, over to the side, and now it's time to paint. And I'm going to choose different color hues of pink, and the stems will be of course green, or should I make them gold? I might make them gold or silver, we'll see. This first flower, I'm going to paint a light pink. I mix this light pink myself. And let's see how it turns out. And you don't have to be perfect. Start out with the outlining. When you run out of paint, just redip it. And the paint that I'm using is an acrylic paint. And it's a flat paint, so it won't have any shine to it. In the end, I will add a clear coat to give it that gloss look. And don't worry about trying to be perfect. You want to give it two coats. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give it its first coat. And then I'm going to let it dry. And as it's drying, I'm going to go on to the second color. <clears throat> and what you want to do is the circle in the middle. You don't want to paint that right away. Because if you do, the color that you use for the middle will blend in with the pink. So we will paint in the circle in the middle of the flower after it's all dry. Cute. 